people, this is what happens when you come visit your friend, you know? Country seat. <laughs> you get some cocoa. <laughs> get your little bag of peppermint. <laughs> clean, clean ginger. <laughs> from Bath, Eastern St. Thomas. And what are we going to be doing later? Oh, okay. This is coffee. Mm -hmm. From Eastern St. Thomas. The bath division, and you and I are going to shell it, mm -hmm. roast it, mill it, drink it, and you all get to watch. We gotta figure this out. So, we're gonna do coffee. I'm so excited. So, come now, my coffee. Farmer's coffee. kitchen. Clean, clean ginger. Oh, you're not taking this back. Ginger <laughs> from the Jamaica Eastern Center. You're not laughing division. about all of this, right? Yes. I you to look at cocoa? Yep. Mm hmm Good, good things. Good, good things. It smells so good. Oh my gosh. I'm, I might I just I'm just mm. <laughs> my hair if you pick off the top, mm -hmm. I can plant it. Some part of the So we're gonna figure it out. We're gonna figure it out. We're gonna plant it. The top. We're gonna plant it. Yeah. Next year this time I got pure peppermint. <laughs> yeah, true, true, for real. Alright, cool. Hi everyone. As promised, today we are gonna show you an episode about coffee, especially the fabulous tasting coffee from Eastern St. Thomas. So what's this episode called? From beans, beans, to the cup, to the cup. I am Chalet today and this is Cherie. Thank you. <laughs> so we're gonna make coffee and before we're gonna tell you some stuff about coffee. So coffee is made from the coffee plant seed mm -hmm. <laughs> and coffee cherries are debulked within 24 hours of picking. And these cherries have to be used and made within 24 hours after coming off the tree. Well, this is how it looks when I got them. This is how it looks when we take the shells off. And we're going to show you how we got it to look like this. And this is a smaller version of what normally happens in bigger factories because they spread it over a large surface and then use bigger machines. But today we're in Michelle's kitchen. So we're gonna do it our way. So come along for the ride and watch us turn these coffee beans. Okay, so here we are. We're gonna show you a couple different ways to get the coffee beans like this to look like these. Before it had on the shells and there are different ways to take the shell off the coffee. So one way they used to do it in the old days is to use this. I don't know what it's called, but it's like Marta where you use the coal pot and you put the coffee beans after it's been dried mm -hmm. um, in it and then it just work. Work it, work it girl, work, work it. it. And of course this is not the right pot. Right, this but. is just a, this is just a showing to you. Right. So these are the shells yeah. that we got these from. And this is how the coffee beans look mm -hmm. after they're de-shelled. Yes. And now we are going to put them in a hot Hot and stir them until they become nice and brown. Come on. So let's follow Michelle. So here we are. The pot is hot, and we're gonna just pour them in. And we have to keep stirring them while they get brown. We're gonna be here for a little bit. We normally have to stir them for about 14 to 20 minutes, and that's what we're gonna do. We just have to keep moving it around. This is roasting the coffee. And coffee is very important to Jamaica's industry because as you know, we're the home of the Jamaica Blue Mountain Coffee. Let them see you when you're talking. The Jamaica Blue Mountain Coffee. <laughs> as we said, we're gonna make a hot beverage and we're gonna make a cold beverage. So the coffee beans are green before they're roasted and Michelle is over there. Shelly is a roasting. And then I'm gonna use some of the coffee that we did before and try to make a cold beverage out of it. So the beans are slowly being roasted. They're turning consistently, and consistently turning. with our arm. <laughs> it's, so they can be evenly. It's, it's not a machine, but it's working. And you have to know exactly how to be consistent with it so that everything gets touched by the heat. Normally it's a slow process in a bigger machine, a turning machine. 
and when the beans are quickly cooled after because of the constant turning, it's just a matter of a few seconds before the batch comes out. The Blue Mountain coffee is amazing. We all know how wonderful Blue Mountain coffee is. This is not Blue Mountain coffee. This is coffee from Hayfield in Eastern St. Thomas, but you know, it's just as good. <laughs> so we'll be back. How long we is get a little bit more brown? About 14 to 20 minutes. So once it gets a little bit brown, like halfway there, we'll come back and show you. All right? This is funny. What could we do to make this flavor? Cinnamon flavored coffee? Mm -hmm. I'm actually seeing some, this looks like a coffee bean now. The other ones did not look that way. No, I have a newfound respect for this woman. She's been stirring like this, like a machine, for the past 20 minutes. Yeah. It I'll takes do what you gotta do. Stick to itiveness and anything for that. To making coffee from scratch. I'm here for moral support and the taster, okay? <laughs> Starting to look a lot like coffee now. Starting to look a lot like coffee. <laughs> so here we are. We're putting in coffee. Mm -hmm. And we're going to percolate. And we'll show you the end results. Just a few minutes, we'll have coffee to drink. Her and her ground is coffee. It's the end result of our coffee. Is that too much light? Can you see it? You hear that? That's what's happening in the percolator. That looks good. So, we've done our need for today. With our natural honey from Jamaica. St. Thomas honey. Look at that. So I hope you liked our video on. Ooh. No, we got it right, people. We got it right. You know, I was a little bit doubtful in Shelley's abilities, <laughs> but um, having Cheers. gone through over half an hour of roasting, I guess the flame is different from the flames that the real people use. For real. But yeah, she did good. Let's hot go. Okay, let's do this. Smells strong. Not bad. It you know, I need, I need creamer. creamer. But Friendly. forgive us. We like creamer. Most real people who really, drink really coffee. drink coffee like it. Straight. Black. So thanks for watching. Support our Jamaican time. farmers. <laughs> our support Jamaican coffee. Go to Cafe Blue. Go to Cafe Dolce. Yes, Enjoy. Starbucks don't have our coffee. I mean, we like Starbucks. Starbucks has our coffee. They have all coffee? They? Yes, I'm almost sure. I'm not too sure about that, us. but I say Cafe Blue and Cafe Dolce. I say Jam all Jamaican, Jamaican coffee. Yes. Mwah. Mountain Peak. Just I forgot that one. I had to throw it in. Bye, guys.